Hey everybody, we have this box of Championship Collection. This is Championship Collection Baseball. Get 10 factory sealed packs, one rookie card in every pack. One rookie card in every pack basically means one Shohei Otani Leaf Draft in every pack. And then 10 packs plus 5 packs of triple play. Which is their way of admitting that triple play is not really packs. But let's get into it. So, yeah, got these at Walmart. Basically, this is one of the MJ Holdings. So it's just like the championship collection football. But that had 20 packs. A lot of leaf. This is uh, 10 packs. Including those triple plays. And a card that they shove down at the bottom. Basically, is a card. So, what do we get out of these packs? So, bonus, bonus, fantasy baseball. It's another bonus, bonus. Five triple play. There's a top series one 2016. Looks like a hanger pack. Panini Golden Age. Panini Golden Age. What year is that? 2014. Three packs. Here's another. This is a 2016 top series two. Top series two. A Chris Bryant. No, Chris Bryant. This is a USA Stars and Stripes 2015 hobby. And then a single pack of 2014 Prism. So let's see. <clears throat> see. There. I always wonder, you know, when I watch most other videos, most people always... They always organize their cards where they keep open everything the same at the same time, but I like variety. And I'm just going to go through these real fast. These are all... Oh, they're just weird. Like... Panini makes real cards. I don't know why they make these. Made these. I don't know who they target. Are they supposed to be funny? These people are so dumb looking. I mean, I just... It almost looks like you would expect if, like, Garbage Pail Kids made baseball cards or something. Now this is one of the Honus Bonus. Hopefully the lawnmower is not too noisy in the background. These ones are sort of like real cards, but not not much better than those other ones. I'm not even saying anybody's names in any of these. There's a foil one. But I don't know if that means anything. I'll keep that card out. More trip play. Tattoos and stickers. And what is that? And who drew that? And someone drew that and thought, oh, that's great. Let's put that in a card. I guess you get one of these foil cards per pack. The only thing I remember about that is my first Aaron Judge rookie card I got was out of one of those. Okay, so now to some sort of real cards. 2014 Panini Golden Age. 
retail. There's a chance of getting a hit out of these because these came out of a blaster box that had one, or usually had one hit per box. Not guaranteed. Oh, little card. Dan Browthers? Brothers? Robin Roberts, Lon Chaney Jr., Jackie Gleason, Frederick Valen Valentich, Kennesaw Mountain Landis. What? The? Those are real names? I don't even know. It's 2016 Top Series 2, actually. I got two Top Series 2 and one Top Series 1. Brad Boxberger, Luke Men Mayo, Santiago Casilla. I'm not gonna say the names. Mike Leak, Ichiro 2500, Jason 3K. Here's an insert. Chris Heston, record setting, no, no, in rookie year. Carl Edwards Jr. rookie, Tanner Rourke, Arizona Diamondbacks, Pitt Wallace. It's another Golden Age. This is a little bit thicker, but it looks like it's might be a decoy. It's a decoy. Pete Rose, Lusitania. It's cool. Bob Hayes. It's a different back. Cadillac Ranch, Ernie Banks, Dizzy Dean. There's another Tops. And Duvall, Franklin Gutierrez, Trevor Brown rookie. Keon Broxton, Aradis. Uh, Future Stars, Lance McCullers. There's another Ichiro, Jason 3000. It's another Golden Age. Ooh, that one's not got a decoy in it. I'm going to save it. That one's thick and it has a hit. So let's go to the 2016 Series 1. Giancarlo Stanton, Baltimore Orioles. Where's the numbered card? Oops. Oh, okay. I think it's a numbered card. Billy Butler. Numbered to 2016. Nice. Finally got my numbered card. Got to get a numbered card when you get that many tops. I thought this was a buyback. This is just one of those reprints. Okay, so Prism 2014. Daniel Mengen, Zach Thompson, Ross Kivett, and RMS Garcia. No color in there. Prism Baseball didn't really ever have a whole lot of color, even though that's what everyone wants. They're all racist. I think that's a decoy. That looks very decoyish. David Dahl, Christopher Martin, Bryce Turin, JP Crawford. Oh, it's not. It's a hit. I got a hit. JP Crawford. Go from the back. Luke and Baker. Mitchell Hansen. Peter O'Brien. So I'll leave that. Let's look at this one first since I opened this pack first. Billy Shoemaker. Ooh, Tony Dow. Mono back. Ken Osmond. Mo Berg. Rube 
Waddell. Oh, see, Rube Waddell. We have a, in the city I live in, there's a place called Waddell's. It's a really cool, really good, like, like a pub restaurant. And it's named after this guy. Anyway. Jake Lamada. Just backwards. Yes. Ooh, Fay Ray. Fay Ray Relic. Museum Age. Fay Ray. Wow. From the original King Kong. Or she was, I see. Actress. Bidding for a part in a horror film. Crime. Queen of Scream. That is awesome. I like it. Let's see what we get out of this. Jake Lemoyne. Relic. Number 299. Okay, so got got actually got two hits out of this. Was not expecting any, but got two relics. And one numbered card. So yeah, 20 bucks. You get some interesting stuff. So I might pick up another one. Keep an eye out. And thanks for watching and keeping an eye for some more videos.